the most unique and creative photorealistic image ever. Wait, you're like for real about this? This is one of my favorite metaphrases to use when generating incredible AI images. But watch what happens next, this specific phrase right here. But first, before we do that, let me just briefly show you what sort of amazing AI images we get from just using this singular phrase by itself. The creations generated with this trick are just like absolutely AI amazing. <laughs> now you can see I used this over here in Midjourney. In fact, this works well in both Midjourney and Freepik. So all of these images that you see were actually created by using this specific phrase. Now, if I take this same exact one and I head over here in the free pick, you can see this first row I chose C Dream 4 4K. And again, I mean, same levels of uniqueness, realism, and creativity, all with just this one single phrase. So that's the good starting point, but we're not stopping here. We're going to go ahead and take this to extreme awesome levels. Now, again, just to show you very quickly in real time, let me paste this in again. I'll stick to C Dream 4 4K. Okay, we'll generate this in free pick, and then we'll generate it again in real time over here in mid journey, just to show you the wide variety of the style and looks of images we're gonna get. Now, while these are thinking, we're gonna actually add one more detail. With that same exact prompt over here on the left-hand side, put a colon, and now just give it a specific subject. In this case, I'm gonna say a gradient hypercar, okay? Copy this again, and we'll do the same thing by pasting this in the mid journey. So that way you can use it as just a standalone phrase and you'll just get a just whatever sort of an image, which I think is a great idea because I honestly wouldn't have even have known how to describe my prompt to look like these right here. But now I'm gonna go ahead and actually use a specific subject. So we'll see how these actually turn out in a second. So now that you know the capabilities and the power of what this phrase can create, let me now show you how to fish. So what I mean by that is instead of just giving you a series of prompts, let me show you exactly how to do this, but we're going to create your very own prompt generator. And it's rather simple than starting off with your favorite phrase. So the first thing you want to do is simply paste in your favorite phrase like I just did in mid journey and free pick either a favorite phrase or a favorite token, something that you've used in the past to generate amazing AI art mastery. Again, here's mine, the most unique and creative photorealistic image ever. And so to give you a quick example and to help you out, I'll stick on this page right here and I'll give you a chance to quickly copy a few of these down. Like here's another great one right here. Sharpest, most unique and creative photo ever in mankind. We also have like a great one right here. This is a dedicated production still from a Hollywood movie. And then I even utilize like warnerbros.com. You could see what we're going to get right here. Amazing creativity and realness. You could see, go ahead and copy a few of these right here. In addition to the cheat code realism one, I'll switch up to a list view or a date view as well. I'll scroll kind of slowly. That way you can go ahead and copy some of these yourself, okay? So we just added two new prompts databases to the incredibly popular everything bundle, the AI video engine and the content king. Want them? Click the links in the description. So we're going to have the keyword MVPs, and then we also have specific prompts that make incredibly realistic and unique images, okay? So just to give you a few examples of what using these creative adjectives can actually do. Now, I mentioned I want to show you how to create a prompt generator based off of your favorite meta token or phrase. Now, a meta token or phrase is just basically a series of adjectives or words you use to create ultimate levels of detail and realism. You also have the same sort of phrases that you can use for AI video, but we'll save that for a separate video. Okay, so after we have this very important phrase right here, okay? The next step would be to say something like this, okay? You're basically going to use any LLM. Today, we'll use ChatGPT, and you're going to say, listen, this is my favorite meta phrase. It creates amazing images. Based off of this phrase or my meta token, I ultimately want a reusable meta prompt generator I can use over and over again. And then I'm going to go ahead and provide it an example. I want the prompt to be formatted the right way. Now, as a quick reminder, the format and these prompts I'm sharing 
today, I'll include via the links in the description. That way you don't have to try to figure out exactly how to recraft this. Now, before we go in the chat GPT, let's quickly take a look at these images that we just got in both free pick and mid journey. Now here's the one in mid journey. Look at this exceptionalism right here. Now I didn't provide a specific subject. That's why I love testing this out right away, just to see the levels of creativity that this can come up with. But now when I utilized my specific subject, a gradient hypercar, look at that. Amazing. So this allows you to have a good reference and starting point to what this sort of metaphrase can do. Let's jump over to free pick and look what we got here. Now I've actually forgot to generate the one for the supercar. Let me generate this while I'm thinking about it. But very quickly, I can also look at these generic ones it created without providing a subject. I mean, Sea Dream 4 4K did a great job as well. These are all realistic, creative, and unique. Exactly what we were looking for. This is crazy good right here. Now, something like this would be perfect to create a video for. But now let's go ahead and open up ChatGPT. First, paste in your specific meta token or phrase, just like that. The most unique and creative photorealistic image ever, okay? Then hit that shift enter. We don't want to hit enter yet because it's not going to know what you need. Then you're going to want to paste the next instruction. The one I just showed you a second ago to where we want to instruct it to create a prompt generator. Now I need to give it a format example. I like to have those hashtags that will separate the specific subject or the instruction with those hashtags. So I'll say format example right here and now colon and now I'll simply paste in a great example. So for that, let's go back to my prompt generators database and I wanna look for something that starts off with that hashtag role and then we'll include role, context, and then finally the instruction. Okay, for an example, here is a good one right here. Do you see how it has hashtag role, context, instruction? Let's go ahead and copy the whole thing just like this. Go back now over into chat GPT and that's gonna be my format example I'm gonna give this. I'm gonna tell chat GPT to do. Now, in full transparency, I haven't tried this method before. I'm doing this in real time with you right now. With that being said, let's hit that send button and then see what this comes up with. If I go back to free pick, I think these images are done. Okay, wow, these look fantastic. All four of my gradient supercar. Realistic, unique, definitely creative. Okay, I love all four. Let's go back to ChatGPT and see what happens next. Here we have it. Below is your upgraded elite reusable meta prompt generator engineered for prompt adherence perfection. Look at this, amazing. Here's my meta tokens, my meta engines. The next step, specify what subject we should hyper realize first or say suggest 10 insane subject ideas. Let's do that. 10 insane subject ideas. So it's going to allow me to test the prompt generator right here in real time. But just to show you very quickly what we can do or how we can use this, let's open up a new chat. I just copied the prompt generator that we just got. We just created on our own. Now that's exactly what it does. It then just first asks you the same thing we just did before. What's the specific subject or suggest 10 extraordinary subjects? Okay, so it did work comparable to what we just did. Let's go back to the original chat. And now here it is. Remember, I scrolled down and I told it suggest 10 insane subject ideas. Look at this. All of these amazing ideas that we could choose from. Now, I'm going to give you one last thing that we can do. So we, we're going to get all of these amazing subjects. Let's just say, for an example, I select number 10. Okay, that astronaut in Eden 2.0. I'll just say number 10. It's going to now give me the responses. It's going to give me the infinite realism engine outputs. Look at all these prompts we're gonna get. Tons of amazing prompts that we could try. So what I did was I generated a few of these, that way we wouldn't have to wait. Check out how amazing these turned out. Digital cage, digital Okay, so there you have it. Great job on all fronts. But now let me show you one last piece. So now what we're gonna do, as I scroll down, again, you can see all these amazing prompts that we got. Let's go back to that other chat we just had. Now on this one, this is where I pasted in the prompt on its own, okay? Now it says, what subject would you like? I'm gonna try something different. These are gonna be some prompts that have created some of the most unique realism, okay? Let's actually download this image. There it is, I downloaded it. It is now in my downloads folder. We're now gonna go back into chat GPT. Watch this. I'm gonna say let's try something different. I'll say I'll upload an image 
for you to use as reference. All right, there we go, as a reference. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead and click and drag in that image that I just downloaded. Downloads folder just opened up. There it is right there. Okay, use this image as my subject. Okay, let's see. There's that image we just downloaded. Now that way, instead of giving it a subject or suggesting 10, there we go, stunning reference, got it. Below are 10 hyper photorealistic prompts based on the uploaded scene. That's awesome. Now watch this. I could copy and paste one of these. Let's say we go back in the mid journey, paste the prompt in, and let's make believe I wanted to use the same consistent character. I think I know who that is, but let's go ahead and repaste it and now add an omni reference image. And okay, great. There's that same image right there. Let's see if it could decipher and regenerate that same character from that image. Okay, well, this one is suggestive pose, even though Midjourney created this. Let's try it again. Paste in that prompt again. We'll select a different Omni image instead. The moderation sometimes gets too crazy. So now we're going to have a couple of images to see how they turned out. I'll do the same thing. I'll try this again in a free pick, specifically with Sea Dream 4. Now, the reason I really love Sea Dream 4 is because I can actually use a character I already created once before. In fact, there is that same one. Let's choose her and let's now generate this one. That way we're going to be able to compare both mid journey and free pick, but using C dream four, four K. Okay. So all of our images are done being generated. Let's look at these and see how they all turned out. Is this real life? I don't know. Gotta get out. Gotta go. Digital walls closing in. So there you have it, a very effective way to create your very own prompt generator simply based off of your favorite phrase or meta token. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below and what sort of meta tokens have you used or phrases that you love that really create some amazing looking images. Please share them in the comments below. I love to see what we all came up with. And remember, if you like this video, please remember to hit that like and subscribe button. I'll see you next time. Subscribe to the mule, yeah, you already know. Click the links below, let the algorithm glow. I'm the prom star, welcome to the show. Type one line, watching the empire grow. I'm the prom star, fixing.